WHAS 11, Good Morning Kentuckiana starts now with Weather First. Good morning, Kentuckiana, and a big happy birthday to GMK. <laughs> we do not look a day over 29. I know, right? We're going to be celebrating our show all day today in a lot of big ways. Yeah, we're really excited, too. Mm -hmm. uh, we're going to see some faces that are familiar to us, certainly familiar to you. Mm -hmm. uh, we're going to relive some memories and maybe create some new ones also. Oh, I can't okay. wait. If you want to stick around with us this morning, we've got some really special guests on the way in this morning. Yeah, it's all an effort to celebrate the 30th anniversary of GMK. Colleen, we could not be more excited about yeah, it. Yeah, it's a, it's, we have a long morning ahead. Definitely want to stick around through it. It's going to be a fun one. So we're going to have a great show. We're going to have a great forecast. But we've got drama, intrigue, and some very special guests. So good morning, Kentuckiana. Eric King here. And I'm Haley Minogue. We are so excited for this show, for drama, the lineup. Intrigue. I know, right? We're going to have some behind-the-scenes action. We absolutely love it. Okay, so we are celebrating the 30th birthday of GMK this morning, Colleen, but uh, it's in the 20s here in Metro Louisville, and it feels like the teens. Yeah, we have a big morning ahead, but it definitely feels cold. Live at 5.30 from the leader in television news, Rachel Platt, Barry Burnson. This is Kentuckiana's news channel, WHAS 11. I miss this part of it. <laughs> <laughs> those were always the worst. I remember having to do those like 15 years ago. We're like, why am I doing that? You have to like start down and look up. I kind of like it. I miss it. I, we should bring it back. We should. I <laughs> love, not only do I love seeing the, the, the vintage show open, uh, Ken Schultz is already here. We'll talk to him in a bit. I love being able to see him. Grew up watching him. Yep. I love that you all get to meet him. Right. And, yeah. and see, right. Like, I'm so excited about what's going on today, celebrating 30 years. So yeah. many special yeah. guests are going to be in the building here with us. And like Eric said, they're people that we watched up, watched growing up. Mm -hmm. um, Ken was always the bearer of the good news, right? When you had a snow day, he was like, and da da da. So <laughs> it's, it's going to be a lot of fun. I don't We're, think everybody saw snow days as good news, though. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> not the everyone. Kids did. Not everyone. The kids, the kids, did. the kids, we were ready for it. Yeah. Um, we are celebrating 30, but we are in the 20s, and it feels like the teens today. For decades, we'd wish you a good morning in Kentuckiana, and now it is time to see all of the wonderful faces who've done it over the years. We're going to reminisce and celebrate our 30th anniversary next. Good Monday morning, Kentucky. Anna. Start your day with GMK. 11 to go, so you're good to go. Right now, so that's... Oh, my gosh, my chair. <laughs> Careful with that chair, though. Tomorrow on GMK, the high school football game of every year. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, trying so hard. Will the St. Eggs knock up the meadow? <laughs> <laughs> my horse, oh my goodness, I'm on TV. I've waited all year for this, and I get to Stargazer, slow down. Hold on, Stargazer, don't leave me. Very embarrassed. No, I'm going to say, I think your daughter is upset for a whole different reason than the fact that the is with you. I have to go to school on Monday. It might be one of them. All right. All right. <laughs> so many great moments featuring so many great people. You can call them all GMK icons. Yeah, and you probably recognize... All of these faces, GMK alum, we've got Renee Murphy, all Kelsey right. Starks, Joe Arnold. First of all, thank you all for coming. <laughs> and early. setting was the it, alarm, right? <laughs> what, what, was it like a culture shock again when that alarm went off? You're like, what? I was <laughs> saying to the ladies that I, to, to me, after you've done this show, you're you're mutated forever. You, you never quite sleep the same again. Yeah. So just, I'm just saying it's, it's your curse. <laughs> yeah, you're right. always a morning person. Yes. yes. Now. yes. What's the experience been like uh, since your time on the show? Because I, I say this, because you all are doing great and amazing big things. Mm -hmm. So you left here and you went out and changed the world. <laughs> yeah. I don't think like, you, you did. You know what, this is, was a great place to be here. I always say this is where I grew up. This is where my heart is. Um, I loved my time at WHAS and even getting up in the morning that 2, 1.45, 2.30, whatever <laughs> time earlier. the alarm went off. <laughs> Um, it was always fun to come here because it was always like home and it was always like family. Yeah. So friends were definitely family. Yes. Uh, co-workers were family. You all saw me with a uh, pregnant with all of my kids. Me too. <laughs> yeah. You know, and so there you were all are. that yeah. life journey with us. That's right. Oh, uh, it's so much fun to watch all this video, see all the different stages that GMK has had, but it has always been such a staple in the community. And like Eric said, you all are all staples in the community now. You continue to contribute, continue to do amazing things. But I have to ask, because we talked a little bit with Ken Schultz this morning. 
when that alarm went off today, did it feel like one of those dreams where you forgot to turn in your homework and you're like, I've been out of school for 10 years. I mean, what was that moment like for you all? I think setting the alarm was a little PTSD, like, oh, here we go, you know, but I was excited to wake up today. Mm -hmm. I was excited to come see all my friends. You know, mm -hmm. we don't get together yeah. as often as we yeah. should, and um, I still see everybody, but the, the one thing to note is that so many of us still are here in Louisville, yes. and I think that says a lot, because mm -hmm. you don't see that in... TV really ever yeah. Yeah. <laughs> people move on but this city I think you know we love it here and this is home and we're still um, just part of this community and we love it you all exemplify something that's so special especially morning in morning reporting um, and anchoring of shows because you all were qualified and credentialed and strong journalists who came to the anchor desk in a role that required not only that but personality also what are you most proud of Joe well, I think more than anything, with what, back to what was Renee was saying, is that we were a, a great team. Mm -hmm. Is that, and there is something about, and it's, it's, it's pleasant, it's wonderful, it's fun in the morning, but at the same time, you're in the trenches. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, you're together, and you know, and you have to think creatively and, and, and team wise to you be able to make like all those each work. Other. Exactly. <laughs> because there's always going to be something like, holy. How did how did how did we get no, yeah. no, 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 we don't cut on TV. Yeah, no, 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 I never have. But my point being is, is that we always found a way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And after it was all over, and there could have been some tense moments during all of that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, no. Who's looking at you and me? <laughs> I, I only work with you. I know. <laughs> no, but it was great. It, 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 we were running together. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I will say this before we wrap up, particularly to you. Because uh -oh. representation Here we're matters. Going. <laughs> representation matters. And the debt of gratitude that so many black women in this city, not just black women, but minorities in general, owe you for the battle that you fought that a lot of people don't even realize with your natural hair. So many of us were put under parameters where we had to look a certain way that was contrary to our culture, and you fought that battle here, and a lot of people don't know that. So thank you for that. Oh, mm -hmm. well, it's very kind of you to say, and I just think that everyone should have the opportunity to just be themselves. And so I was able to share my very authentic story, and um, I hope it connected with others. It did. Mm -hmm. It did. Absolutely. We are not done just yet. Not at all. No, we are not done celebrating, guys. We have a lot more special guests that are going to be joining us today in-house here. But first, we are going to go over to Colleen with that forecast. Colleen, it is chilly outside today. Yeah, it is very cold. And hey, I'm not lonely here. We have Ken Schultz in the Weather Center. We're having a great time, and we'll have him on er uh, later in the morning. So you definitely want to stick around. 29 degrees outside as we head into the weekend. But before we get there, it is time to end off this week on a high note with our 30th anniversary. <laughs> Good morning to you, I'm Eric King. And I'm Haley Minogue. We are really celebrating here this morning on GMK, and there's so much to be proud of, right? Yeah. We have years and years, decades, really, of service to the community here in Kentuckiana, bringing you all of your news, your sports, and of course, your weather. We've had some isolated reports of some trees down. Wouldn't believe how close showers are. Look for those showers and thunderstorms. And better than an inch of rain possible. It looks like yet another snow day. It is time to seek shelter. That will stay to our north. Those clouds will move because of a storm system moving in. This Alden German here, Storm Team uh, Weather Center. Take a look at all the ones that have come before you, Sam, Colleen, <laughs> Ed, Ken Schultz, Chris Phillips, Kristen Cornett, Ben Pine, T.G. Shug, Caitlin Fish, Chelsea Smith, Alden German. Um, that made me weirdly emotional. I know. Oh my I, goodness. It, Chelsea trained me. I miss oh, her. I miss she? Chelsea. Yeah. She's doing great at our sister station in Indianapolis. Yeah. TG's in Lexington now. Mm -hmm. Caitlin's still in Louisville. So we many, still got Ben. I know. Still, <laughs> got, we said, we got, still ben. got Ben. We've got so many amazing faces that we just saw there. Well, and Ben's a great story. Ben started as a meteorologist, yeah. worked his way up to the I'm seeing the throwback ben. videos. Yeah. It's, 2008. It's something about it. 2009. What I love is seeing Ken Schultz here right now oh, yeah. and you all yeah. just soaking up every bit bit of personality and knowledge mm -hmm. that he's offering you as a Yeah, player. we have been picking his brain. 30 years yeah. here being a meteorologist, I mean, there's just so much to learn. That's such, like, an, uh, it, it, we admire him. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, I wish I grew up in the market and watched him. You yeah. know what I mean? <laughs> it would have been fun. Hello, friends. Remember me? It's Juliana Valencia. I anchored on GMK starting in 2016 for several years, and I loved, loved my time in Louisville. Since I moved, I've been a reporter here in our nation's capital. Haley and Eric, you guys are doing a great job. Happy 30th anniversary and good morning, Kentuckiana.
Oh, that no, gives me goosebumps. It makes me so happy. I started here when Juliana was still here, and she was such a great lover of the show, a great friend of the show. She's and was bilingual, offering bilingual, bilingual Spanish language uh, yes. uh, news. I love Juliana. We are so happy that she joined us from D.C. to wish us a happy anniversary. Uh, Juliana, I think she is working the morning shift as well mm -hmm. most days, so hope you're up bright and early with us. That was a great Thanks surprise. Thanks for joining us. I didn't I know, know that right? was going to be there. <laughs> We're full of surprises this morning, and it's only getting better in the next half hour. Temperatures right now, mid 20s. Feels like the teens out there. It's the mother of all morning news shows. My daughter is upset for a whole different reason than the Stargazer. Is right. Oh my gosh, I love this. We are celebrating this Friday morning. It's been 30 years of Good Morning Kentucky, and we can actually hear the laughs coming from well, the studio across I think the hall. Terry Miners must be here because people are over there cracking up, and that always happens when he walks in. Oh my gosh, we do want to say thank you not only to all those that have come before us that have really made GMK what it is today, but also to all of our viewers. We are so thankful that you have woken up with us all of these years, really setting the precedent for what morning news should be in Kentucky. And it's so special. Uh, what these men and women have meant, particularly to us since mm -hmm. we grew up watching, and what they are starting to mean for you all, <laughs> right. spending so much time with them today. Uh, it, it's just great to be able to sit and kind of share the air. Absolutely. Yeah, we've been talking nonstop in the Weather Center with Ken. <laughs> 30 years being a meteorologist, yeah. there's so much to learn. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's so, uh, you know, we just admire it. We're taking <laughs> weather notes, we're taking life yeah. advice notes. Life advice. Oh, yeah. He has eight grandkids, <laughs> right. you know, he's got it all well, figured out. What are the weather notes this morning? Weather, it's going to be very cold, as Ken said. Okay, Colleen, thank you. For decades now, we have said good morning, Kentuckiana. And now it is time to see a number of the wonderful and amazing faces that have done that over the years. Let's take a trip down memory lane for our 30th anniversary. That's next. I want my kids, I've been uh, uh, very tough with them about following strict role models. And look at them, look how well they're growing up now. Max, it's time to wake up, buddy. Oh, Daddy, do I have to? <laughs> yeah, you have to get up. Oh, what is Chris Turner doing there? What is this Simon? Story? Simon, it's time to get up. Come on, buddy. It's time for pancakes. <laughs> oh. Come on, son. You did not get me to have pizza. No, you did not get your homework done last night either. Oh, Since when do Chuck Olmstead and Chris Turner <laughs> spend the night with you? He was he was having nightmares all night. Are you okay now, son? I feel, I feel Hold on. And the bed's dry. <laughs> 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 oh my gosh, I love it. <laughs> so the laughter that you're hearing right now is authentic happening right now in the studio because this is hilarious. We've been counting down the 30 years of GMK. We've been doing that for the past 10 days mm -hmm. and we're so excited to welcome all of you in with us this all morning. All these old when people. I, oh, stop I, it. I was born in the 70s. Don't talk to me about that. I remember Jimmy Carter. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, we are so happy that you are here with us this morning. A lot of familiar faces, a lot of people that have hung around Louisville, and we love that so much. Yeah. So, Rachel, we'll start with you just because ladies first. So, wait a minute, gentlemen. Yeah, move Always them out of here. Right Always <laughs> start with right and, and Rachel Berry, the show started with you guys. It did. Mm -hmm. Right. And we were kind of an unlikely coupling, right? We I mean, we were even surprised. Our news director at the time, Mike Rausch, uh -huh. had the vision that people were going to bed earlier and getting up earlier. And so, that is when Good Morning Kentucky Anna really expanded and ultimately became like a three hour program. Mm -hmm. But he was right. He was right. People's lifestyles were changing, and we just kind of rode that wave. And it was a ball, because, you know, we had worked together, but hadn't been not, paired not, together not, as not, anchors. Not and it was husband and wife, you know? Yeah, and well, they became like an old married couple. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> here we are. And here we are. I was exactly. their child. <laughs> <laughs> and Ken Mom, Schultz. Dad. Yeah, he was the one you always had to rein in, was Ken Schultz. Oh, well, he was in this room over here, actually. Yeah. <laughs> I think what we're getting here, and of course, Ken and Andy and Terry, I think what we're getting here, is this was more than co-workers. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. I mean, the, the oh, way yeah. that you all are interacting right, right now is vastly different than what most people would be like with their co-workers from the last Right. 15, Rachel pulled years. me into this show, and we had this producer who had a really funny southern accent, and, they, and she'd get a call, What? You need somebody to wrestle a bear? <laughs> 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 oh, my gosh. I feel like hijinks were always kind of afoot on this show, right? And we talked about it a little bit before we just came on, um, but it sounds like everyone was up and ready to go, so it sounds like that morning mentality kind of sticks with you, right? Well past being on GMK. Well, you, you know, if you get up at a quarter of three in the morning or whenever you get up, it, you sort of feel like a monk, you know? Yeah. You're, you're doing holy orders. <laughs> 
some form or fashion. <laughs> and so we all Let's kind of shared that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The one good thing about get, uh, you know getting here before four in the morning is there's no traffic, no. and you can park anywhere you want. True. Yeah. True. And, 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 that's a bond, though, and, and you, you guys can learn to nap in a corner. Oh, I am oh, good to sleep yeah. yeah. anywhere. It, it's a bond that you form with other people because they have the shared experience that mm. very few people actually have yeah. in the world. You uh -huh. know, and and you know it was an amazing chapter I think for all of us. You alluded to earlier, that, you know, people having various degrees of success afterwards. It's no secret why the show is successful. It's because of the people. Mm -hmm. And it's no secret why they're successful after the show. It's because of the people. Mm -hmm. What are you most proud of? The community events, you know, the things that we're involved with, helping people who need a little boost. They need to be amplified. You guys are still doing it now, and that's the beautiful part of this, too. The crusade is, for us, the epicenter of everything. But, but we spread out. So the whole community, I think, gets to hear about important things in the early morning too, so it helps that And situation. I do think that you form a bond in the morning because it's that shared experience of no one really wants to be up at that hour, <laughs> right. but you have to be. Mm -hmm. yeah. So you, you bring that camaraderie. You can work the midnight shift <clears throat> and everybody gets that. And by the way, all those that are working midnight shifts, good for them. Yeah. Like yeah. 3 a.m. to noon? Well, and one thing we say, weird. you know, yeah. one thing we say, and I'm sure you share, when someone's having a rough time, you know, it's so early, I'm so tired. Well, it's 3 o'clock for all of us. Yeah. Right? yeah. yeah. So, so you're there to make it a little easier. Yeah, of course. The whole idea of the show was basic information <laughs> presented pleasantly. Yes. And it's kind of a radio show because people are not watching so much as they are listening. Mm -hmm. Get we their kids to, ready. We used to say, you know, here's something you've got to see, you know, and that would Bring them back in. The, One thing we did want to do too is thank everybody behind the camera. Yeah. Too. This Cuddle. is just a microcosm right. of our no producers. Yes. Yes. Our floor directors, Tommy, texted me at four this morning <laughs> saying, Good morning, Kentucky. Oh. <laughs> so, just so t for everybody who has served on this, right. on this, this is show. just the tip of the iceberg. When well, you saw me grabbing Haley's hand a second ago, it's because we've been talking about how great you all were and what we love about you all. But what's your favorite thing about us? <laughs> Everything. <laughs> Quickly. Pleasant and get me up in the morning. Morning yeah. with that smile. Oh, I didn't expect the next way. Really There's great energy. We like what you guys are doing, continuing on, keep carrying the torch. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's the right people. Up. It's the same same reason you watch. It's the same reason we watch. It's the mm -hmm. people. It's the dynamic. You guys have great chemistry. And 30 years from now, <laughs> when you're on this show, okay, take the time to to tell the folks that have followed you, mm -hmm. to to give them tips like. What I learned working with Barry and, and Rachel, I, I learned some Jewish words that you can never use. Oh, <laughs> I know what that is. I called Rachel. up something that I really didn't know what it meant until after I said it. Oh, right. no. And it's the graphics. But the other thing, too, is... That was never... on air. Behind the scenes, I'd call you whatever. <laughs> you called me that on air! Well, is this the well, SCH also, word? I think I know what it is. Never well, I will... have a turtle on the air with you live right. that hasn't had its six-month constitutional. Okay. I will tell you how much it means to all of us to mm -hmm. have you all here. Seriously. Uh, just seeing you all sharing the air with you all and knowing what you guys have done over the years. Hands in, family! Yeah. 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 One, two, three. Yeah. Yeah. Don't go away. Right. We got more coming up. We're gonna start with Weather and Colleen. Oh, do we have to go to me? Can we just stick it over there? That's so awesome uh, to see all of you guys here this morning and looking back on the past 30 years. Good morning. Well, we have Ken Schultz here. He was a meteorologist for 30 years. Wow. You know, it just <laughs> that is admirable. Thank and you. it just doesn't feel right for me to do the weather, so I think it's only best. It would be an honor for you to take it over. Thank you. So, this is like a weird version of Groundhog's Day. I went to sleep 15 years ago and woke up this morning. So, all right, well, listen, you're headed out. It's dark, obviously, but there's a couple of surprises for you this morning as you head on out the door. First of all, there may be a little bit of snow on the back porch. Be careful. There could be a few slick spots out there. Let's take a look at live action cam down here, downtown. Of course, it's dark. It's cold. How cold is it? <laughs> We're talking about 18 at Bedford, for an example. That's air temperature. Otherwise, we're looking at low to mid 20s across the entire region right now. As for what it feels like, it feels like upper teens to low 20s, mid teens, 15 degrees down around E Town. Be prepared for that. And as you step on out the door and you're preparing for your day, look at this. We're talking about temperatures that will rise slowly but end up in the upper 40s by later on this afternoon. Looking for a little bit of sunshine here to end the day. Also, let me say this it is going to be windy. <laughs> yeah.
I love that Colleen actually you had. Did you see how Ken just stepped right in front of me? I love that Colleen was the one who was asked to rap Ken. I was like, you can't rap Ken. Oh my goodness. That is fantastic. Now, Joe, your mom made this cake, right? Yes, ma'am. Well, how about that, right? <laughs> how about so that? We love it. 30 years here on wow. GMK. What a celebration, yeah. guys. Well, and we'll mention also, uh, we've talked to all the people that you see in front of us, but uh, Rachel, you were perfect uh, and smart to point out the people who work behind the scenes. We've got Sam Gray, who, yeah. We've got Sam Gray back there, who's our director right now. Oh my gosh, what an honor truly to have you all here with us. We appreciate you. Not, you know, a lot of you didn't wake up with us because you've always been up with us, right? So thanks for coming in, uh, making that early adjustment to your schedules for the day. And we've just loved hearing all the laughs and the memories and everything we can glean from you all. Today. And most of us would leave here at 7 a.m. and say, is the bar open? <laughs> <laughs> and thanks to Barry, so is it? the name of the show. It was going to be Good Morning in the Yucky. <laughs> I would prefer good morning Kentucky or good morning y'all, but on behalf of all of us, the level of integrity that you all brought to this desk and this show, uh, thank you for that and thank you for spending the morning with us. Thanks to all of you. Yay! Yay!